Okay, hi, this is Brian from Metagaplist.com. Um, today, I'm going to speak about um, the question, what is Medicare? Uh, most people turning 65 are looking for information about Medicare and or Social Security. Um, Social Security Act of 1965, um, they had created um, a thing called Medicare. Um, the program was set up to um, provide senior citizens with health insurance. Now the Centers for Medicare and Medicaid Services uh, administer um, the Medicare program, but you actually, when you turn 65, you actually sign up through the Social Security office. If you are taking early Social Security, um, you're automatically signed up for Medicare, and if you don't want it, you actually have to contact them and um, explain to them that you don't want it, usually through the mail, which is very simple, or through the uh, Social Security office. Um, so what exactly is Medicare? It's a uh, federal health insurance program that provides the uh, basic benefits for health insurance uh, for people that are over 65 or people that are um, coming off disability insurance and are disabled. Um, there are four sections of Medicare, and I'm going to explain them. The first section is Medicare Part A. This uh, covers um, hospital care uh, and services in the hospital. The second section is Medicare Part B. Um, this insurance covers the um, outpatient medical center or doctor's office part of Medicare. The third section is what they call a Medicare Advantage plan um, or a um, Medicare Part C. What this is, is um, it actually takes you off of original Medicare, puts you on um, a private insurance plan, and um, they take care of Medicare Part A and B, um, and your other coverage is somewhat like uh, coverage you would have with just independent insurance. They actually, um, for an additional fee, most companies, you know, you can uh, put on Medicare Part D and get yourself a prescription drug plan. So if you're on a Medicare Advantage plan, this pretty much takes care of all of your uh, Medicare package. Um, it's a little, little bit different than original Medicare. Um, the fourth part is Medicare Part D. This covers your uh, prescription drugs. And when you get a Medicare Part D plan, um, you choose a company, they have a premium, which means you pay, let's just say, $25 for the plan. Um, these comp when you purchase the drugs, um, you still you pay the premium each month. But when you purchase the drugs, you um, most of the time have to pay either a deductible if the plan has one, or um, um, a copay, and it could be a deductible and a copay. But most likely you're going to pay a copay for the drugs, uh, whether it's four dollars or whether it's a hundred dollars for the drug or two hundred dollars. Um, you could have a deductible and a copay. Um, so keep in mind. What the government gives you, whether you pay for it or not, if they give you Part A, uh, Part B, if you're getting Part uh, C or Part D, nothing is covered 100% uh, unless it's a very special circumstance. So just because you get uh, Part A and you have hospital coverage, it's not going to cover it 100%. Same thing with Part B. If you go to the doctor, it's not covered 100%. Um, so, you know, the people either get a Medicare supplement plan to fill in the gaps um, or they, you know, sometimes there's state programs um, that cover the drug coverage and so forth. But uh, for most people, it's not covered 100%. So, some experts say there's two avenues to Medicare um, insurance. And the question is, is this true? Uh, yeah, this is, this is uh, what most people say. Your first avenue would be if you want to go with an original Medicare plan um, with um, original Medicare Part A and B with a Medicare supplement plan um, and then put on a Part D prescription drug plan. And, of course, um, you'd have to get uh, dental vision and hearing if that's what you want. That, that would be separate. But that's one avenue that you can go to. Another avenue is to get a Medicare Advantage plan. Um, and this kind of package ever, packages everything together. Um, you'd have your Part A and B. Um, you could sign up with a prescription drug plan with that Advantage plan. Um, vision, hearing, and dental. Uh, most of them 
have uh, that you can sign up with, and they also have things such as um, you know gym memberships and so forth and other uh, different things that you can um, tack onto your package. So those are the two avenues: original Medicare with a Medicare supplement, and you get a Part D plan. Uh, I like to say it's like a buffet. You pick and choose from different companies and different plans and put it all together to create your package. Or a Medicare Advantage plan, which packages it all together. Um, if you're confused, um, I'm sorry. I was trying to make this quick and and uh, subtle for you. But you can go to MedigapList.com and read through all the different pages there. There's actually a link right underneath here, um, MedigapList.com. If you put your... Uh, cursor over it, it and it should turn blue and you can click and go right to it or it should be right up here um, where you can just type it into um, the URL address and go right to it. Thanks for watching this video. I hope it was helpful. Have a great day.